This is a construction update for the week of October 28th, provided to you by the City of Somerville and read to you by Hina, part of the Somerville Media Center. Improvement Projects Beacon Street Reconstruction Overnight throughout the week of October 28th and potentially during the day if weather or schedules require, crews plan to continue installing the green surface treatment on the northbound bike facilities from approximately Kent Street progressing towards Oxford Street. There is an odor to the material that may be noticeable during application. Mass dock contractors plan to continue installing signage and construct speed bumps on Sacramento Street and Forest Street. Please expect variable parking restrictions and bike lane closures. Beacon Street remains an active construction site and cyclists are advised to continue using the bike detour until the project is complete. Green Line Extension The GLX team will host their next public meeting Tuesday, November 19th at the East Somerville Community School. During the week of October 25th and the week of October 28th, construction activity is expected to continue daily and overnight within the rail corridor, various work zones between Washington Street and College Ave in Medford. GLXC crews will advance to work on foundation walls, utilities, and will begin installing noise panels while commuter rail service is suspended to meet critical end-of-year deadlines. As a reminder, a construction train used for excavation and hauling materials will be active during nights and weekends and is required to use its horn for safety purposes when it stops and starts. More detailed information about upcoming and ongoing work throughout the GLX alignment can be found bi-weekly for construction updates from MassDOT. Frequent overnight and weekend work is expected to continue throughout the end of the year. If you need assistance for any GLX construction matter, please call 24-7 GLX hotline at 1-855-GLX-INFO or email info at glxinfo.com. Sacramento Street Underpass Rehabilitation The underpass is expected to remain closed until later this fall. The finished railings are currently being installed as others are fabricated and galvanized. Somerville Ave Utility and Streetscape Improvements Weather permitting, during the week of October 28th, contractors plan to install new water main on Somerville Ave between Webster Ave and Prospect Street. Roadway work is planned on Somerville Ave between Prospect Street and Merriam Street. Contractors also plan to be at Washington Street McGrath Highway intersection, conducting urgent work required to facilitate installation and activation of another new water main on Somerville Ave. Pending completion of Eversource electrical work, city contractors will begin demolishing duct banks in front of Stone Ave in advance of installing a new portion of the box culvert drainage system. Somerville High School building project. At the Western Way, crews will begin installing overhead ducts, sprinklers, and plumbing over the next several weeks. Work will also continue on the facade and the roof. Contractors will begin roof steel installation at the former library slash future theater and electrical work at the gym. Steel work is also underway at the Eastern Wing. Washington Street and water main upgrades. Weather permitting, contractors plan to finish water main installations at the Washington Street, Line Street intersection, Monday, October 28th. The intersection is expected to be closed for through traffic during work hours. Later in the week, they plan to install tees on Washington Street between Dane Street and Hawkins Street, requiring parking restrictions and lane shifts. Pavement and Sidewalk Management Program Sidewalk Reconstruction Medford Street will have reconstruction on Central Street to Glenwood Road. Citywide Manhole Rehabilitation National Water Main The city's contractor is rehabilitating manholes throughout Somerville through the spring of 2020. Lane closures and lane shifts and parking restrictions may be implemented as needed. During the week of October 28th, crews plan to be on the following streets. Broadway, from Powderhouse Square to North Expressway. From Burnham Street, Caddy Ave, Cameron Ave, Chandler Street, Chester Street, College Ave from George Street, and Medford to Powderhouse Square. Corinthian Road, Cottage Ave, Dover Street, Electric Ave, Grove Street, Highland Ave from Davis Square to Medford Street, Orchard Street, Packard Ave, Pearson Road, Powderhouse Boulevard, from North Street to Powderhouse Square, Sawyer Ave, and Sterling Street. Additional utility work. Utility companies are responsible for notifying their residents prior to conducting any work, but we expect parking restrictions and lane shifts due to the following utility work. Detail officers may close down the road if deemed necessary for safety. 
Eversource will be doing construction on Berkeley Street, Brosto Ave, Dearborn Road, Highland Road, Olive Square, Pearson Road, Seven Pines Ave, Winter Street, and National Grid will also be doing construction on Middlesex Ave. Eversource Gas Trends Restorations, weather permitting on Wednesday, October 30th and Thursday, October 31st, Eversource contractors will mill and pave isolated sections of the street listed below, where gas work was conducted last year. Streets may be closed off for through traffic with some parking restrictions. On-site crews will manage access for abutters. Those streets are Belmont Street, Oak Street, Pittman Street, and Preston Street. This has been a construction update for the week of October 28th, provided to you by the City of Somerville and read to you by Lena, part of the Somerville Media Center.